Today we celebrate the feast of St. Vincent de Paul. There is so much we can speak of this great saint of charity. He was a French priest who dedicated himself to serving the poor. He established hospitals, founded the Congregation of Priests for Missions, by which Vincent and the members of zealous secular priests bond themselves to live in community and devote themselves to the salvation of poor country people. They also focused on seminary formation. He held regular retreats for both priests and lay people. He even founded Congregation of the Sisters of Charity with the help of St. Louis de Marillac. Besides the great hospital at Paris, where thousands of destitutes were sheltered and given useful work to do, he even started founding home and old people could stay, an asylum for the insane and an institution for the cure of lepers. He even ransomed 1,200 slaves by paying $6 million which he collected from the people. We can go on telling the works of Vincent de Paul. And my dear friends, his humility, trust in the divine providence or praiseworthy. He shunned publicity. This great saint died on September 27, 1660 and was canonized by Pope Clement XII in 1737. As we celebrate this feast of this great saint, the patron of all the societies whose works of charity are seen today, the thousands of people are helped. Let us pray to him. O glorious St. Vincent de Paul, the mention of your name suggests a litany of your virtues, humility, zeal, mercy, self-sacrifice. It also recalls your many foundations, works of mercy, congregations, societies. The Church gratefully remembers your promotion of the priesthood, inspire all charitable workers especially those who minister to both the spiritually and the materially poor. O Lord, give us the grace that you bestowed upon your servant, St. Vincent de Paul, to relinquish the temptation of material things in our holy effort to minister to the poor. Amen. <laughs>